All right. In true typical fashion, I am like a day late for uh, the new trailer for Honkai Star for Miss Firefly. In fact, uh, we got a new trailer out coming out her character demo because her as of recording her pet, the patch is now live. She has just come out. Uh, I've already got her in like one ten pull because obviously that's my fucking girlfriend. Of course, she of course she wants to be with me. Duh, <laughs> obviously. Uh, I totally didn't build up pity for like last month and then ended at 60 and then did one tempo and won the 50 50. Totally didn't do that. But uh, the point is, her trailer is here. Uh, I haven't seen it yet. I'm excited. Uh, yeah, not really much to say. I, I'm stoked for Firefly as a character. She is very cute. She's like, if you get, hey, you get the best of both worlds. You get a adorable little girl and you get Pacific Rim. So, you know, it is what it is. I'm I'm curious what's gonna happen. Why does why does every trailer for Firefly start off with like fucking craziness? Holy fuck! It's like I'm looking at Detroit. I lied. I mean L.A. <laughs> Why she got the veins popping out her face? <laughs> Bro, she like relapsing? Why she have a new? She have like PTSD? Well, I guess she would. She did watch all her friends die in a cold, in a horrid way. She. That was actually. Let's back up for a second. Cause I didn't actually quite that. Cause I want to read that. Hold up. Wanted dead or alive bounty nine point seven seven billion. Yeah, nine point seven billion. God, is that higher than Kafka's? What was Kafka's? I don't remember what Kafka's was. I think okay. I think Kafka's is probably the highest because Kafka. But goddamn. They don't explain why she's wanted as well. Because you have to remember, the Stellar Hunters are wanted criminals, right? So even though we're, like, really cool with them, they're, like, our homies, but, like, we have to remember that they probably did some uh, a hate as shit to be, to have, to have a 9.7 billion bounty. You have to, have, you have to have to do some hate as shit. Like, let's not forget that. <laughs> like, don't get me wrong. I get that she's a very cute girl with uh, humongous moves, but, you know, it is what it is. Let's not forget she has a 9.7 billion bounty on her head. Let's, let's not forget that little that little little thing there. Bro, she's just she's throwing hands with another mech. That's sick. Oh shit, okay, well, you'd be careful, oh, you would be careful there. That frame right there. You need to be careful of that shit right there, bro. That, that fuck, you even see the thigh gap, bro. Like, Twitter is gonna have a fucking field day. Like, yeah, you can't, like, let's not forget how fucking thirsty Twitter is, right? You have to remember, these are the, these are the same dudes that want to get stepped on by JPEGs. Like, let's not forget that. <laughs> Oh god, now she can choke too. God, this is like the start to the most fucked up hentai. Then who will you be in the future? She's getting experimented on? God damn. These are memories. Like destiny, it cannot be defied. But before that, I still have the right to choose. Yeah, that's also the other cool thing about that's also the other cool thing about like fucking Firefly. You can make so many references to Firefly. Bro, Strip looks like a Powerpuff girl over here. Fucking Powerpuff girl going Power Ranger. Yo, go go Firefly. Fucking go go Firefly. Yas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Bro, this is, she yeeted that dude through the, like seven buildings. You can never go wrong. You can never go wrong with two mechs going at each other. But, like, that's why that's why Pacific Rim was such a cool movie. I don't remember fuck all from that movie, but I just remember giant robots pushing the shit out of each other. Okay, that's that's cool. Okay, genuine take. I feel like maybe Firefly will probably be the most in depth. Will have the will will be the character that has the, one of one of the characters that has the most that has the most depth because she is definitely the character that has the most trauma. We, also, we still don't we still don't know anything about about um not Firefly. We still don't know anything about Kafka though, which is kind of a shame because it's like what over a year this game has come out and like. Kafka is like literally one of the first people we saw in the game and we still know fuck all about her like we literally know nothing about her still so that's that's kind of annoying but uh for the most part I do think Firefly was probably going to be one of the characters that has the most depth at least I hope so because I really do like a character a lot jokes aside was that Kalis? Was she? Oh, that's cute. She's getting ready for Kalis. That's cute. Oh, but that's also funny because I know for a fact it's probably pissed off Twitter because that wasn't stealth. <laughs> oh my god. If I know if I know Twitter, bro, if I know Twitter. Because because uh if I know Twitter, because this wasn't stealth. Right, these are these are Kalish's shoes. If if because this wasn't Stell, it's probably pissed off a lot of people being like, ah, I can't believe they did this to Stell or not Stell to Firefly. Like, uh, Fireflies, like, cause like this is basically implying that like the trail, at least maybe not Kalis, but the Trailblazer in general is like has a very special relationship with the Firefly. And like the fact that they just use Kalis, I know I know for a fact so many people are seething, seething that Firefly that they didn't just let Firefly be another gay girl to scissor each other. That's the thing, right? Especially with this community, bro. Like, and, I don't know what it is. Like, they just want everybody to be fucking gay. I don't get it. Like, oh my god! If like it's like if it, if it's straight, that then it's the spawn of Satan. I don't get it. I don't get it. But it is what it is. I mean, you can't lie. That was adorable. But I don't. I just. I just. I just. I just find that so funny. I can't get away. I just know. I fuck. I. I just know if I go on Twitter right now, it's probably gonna be captions. It's probably gonna be quotes and fucking screenshots of that last like five seconds of like people just being mad that. <laughs> that Firefly is, is implied to be straight <laughs> like because they did that with Robin no because they did that with Robin because like apparently like Robin like people were pissed off that like people like didn't want to accept the fact that Robin might actually be straight and like people were like <clears throat> people were like insanely pissed off about that I don't know this Twitter I, st I tend to stay away from the cesspool that is Twitter but sometimes it's fun to check out what's going on in that place it's very interesting but you know <laughs> it's what it is so that was the trailer. That was a pretty good trailer, in my opinion. Not my favorite. Not one of my favorites. Um, I think they set the bar way too high with, with Sparkle's trailer. Uh, but uh, but I mean, to be fair, I'm more of a guy. I'm more of a person where if it's a short clip, I just want cool shit to happen. Which not to say that the cool shit didn't happen in this trailer, but like you also have to remember, Sparkle's tr trailer was literally an acid trip. That was literally Sparkle's trailer. And then fucking Acheron's trailer was like, we just watched her cut a black hole in half. And then fucking, and then in this trailer, Firefly just became a Power Ranger. I mean, it was so cool. I mean, it's still a good trailer. Not one of my favorites. Probably like, if I had to rank it, of all the Honkai Star Wars trailers, uh, I would have to say, like, first would be Kafka's, and then, like, Sparkle's, and Acheron's, and then hers, and then hers. Hers, hers, hers is my top five. Hers is my top five. This is a good, this is a good trailer.